Hello, I'm Ashira Blazer. I am a rheumatologist and assistant professor of medicine and the co-director of the Lupus Center at the University of Maryland in Baltimore. I am here enjoying the ACR meeting and I have had a great time learning about the new guidelines and also new therapies here. And I think it really drives me to be a rheumatologist knowing that I am able to bring state-of-the-art therapies to my patients and affect change in ways that we never have before. This year, I am happy to say that I am now on the board of directors of the Lupus Foundation of America, and this is a wonderful position because I'm able to advocate for my patients, I'm able to have a national voice, and to bring the perspective of a physician who also has a family history of lupus into the fold. So I'm very excited to be attending the ACR meeting with this new position. I think the hottest topics this year for the ACR meeting are around the new guidelines for the management of SLE and lupus nephritis. In the past, we have thought that giving long-term glucocorticoids was appropriate, but there's so much information out that patients who require long-term glucocorticoids or even have low-grade activity actually develop damage. And so I think the treatment guidelines are really telling us that we can start to implement advanced therapies earlier and we can start to affect change for our lupus patients, meaning we can affect the natural history of the disease, the natural course of the disease. And I think that's a very important message and I'm very excited about those sessions.